if you see your culture in your school, if you see your culture in your curriculum, um, if you see your culture valued, you know, if you see your culture around you, it says to you, my culture is important. Mm. Um, and it says then to you, I, am, I'm, I have value, I, I am of worth. In the year 2013, Anishinaabe artist and educator Wayne Vallier, Minogizic, partnered with folklorists and artists at the University of Wisconsin-Madison to build a birch bark canoe on campus. Integral to that project, called Wigwasi Jiman, These Canoes Carry Culture, was the involvement of students from the Envision program of Lac de Flambeau Public School who assisted in the harvesting of the materials in and around the reservation, and who came to the UW campus to participate in the work of the canoe's construction. The following spring, the finished canoe was brought back to the reservation for a public celebration and launching. Students and staff of the school, along with parents, elders, and the wider Lac de Flambeau community, came together to mark and to celebrate an important step in the restoration of the Ojibwe canoe tradition among young people of the community. Because of the success of the project, Administrators at the school invited Wayne to construct another canoe in 2015, this time on the campus of Lac de Flambeau School. The fall of that year marked the first meeting of these two canoes, when they were used by the school's eighth graders to harvest manomen, wild rice. Bonjour, in the way Hello everybody, welcome to Minis Zagai Ganing. Manomen, okay, wild rice, is the single most reason why the Anishinaabe are here where we're at in northern Wisconsin. A lot of you know what Manomen Ikewin is, know what a Manomen Kong is, a rice bed is. You guys have been exposed to this, probably a lot of your families. Those of you that haven't, that's why we're out here. We're out here for you that haven't. Okay, so as Wayne will be paddling me forward, the rice is on the side of me, coming up from behind me. I take my gun, I reach over and I grab some stalks. I pull them as I'm crossing like this. And it's a sweeping motion over the top of those heads. Wah, 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 wah. Reach over, grab some more rice that's coming up behind me, pulling it forward. Whack, 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 whack. You'll, you'll get a rhythm after a while. is to uh, teach our, our language that's been uh, basically stripped from our people 100 years ago. So we're making sure that our language stays alive and our people. Always up and ace to go, a pitain dog, a pitain dog, what? A waste yug, minawa, get the ganug. Always honor and respect your older brothers, the plants and the animals. I want people separated. I want some girls and boys together. Nice. Come with us. Oh, we already have that. Dirt.
I mean, that was yeah. phenomenal this yeah. morning that to see beautiful. the teachers go yeah. out mm -hmm. with mm -hmm. the kids, mm -hmm. which says, without saying a word, of course, which says, we think this yeah. is important. Yeah. We, and, and we're all teachers and we're all learners. Yeah. You know, yeah. Today yeah. we're learning from you, mm -hmm. going out, we're learning yeah. from you. Now the next step is we really need to have more Native teachers. Yeah. I mean, that's really important. Mm -hmm. um, but you know, we're, I, I think we're moving in a good direction. It's mm. wonderful. Isn't it it's exciting? Waswagening means home to me. Um, Waswagening, Lake of the Torch. That's where my people came from. Anin, Makwani Ndu Dain Waswagening in Nujiba, the modern condition of Kazoyen. Hello, I'm uh, Wayne Valier Jr. I live in Lake of Flambeau. I'm a native from there. I'm Ojibwe. My clan is Bear. And uh, I'm currently, I'm first year AmeriCorps. I'm going to school to become a language teacher, language culture teacher. What does the Kwin mean? Minoman and Kwin is uh, just saying Minoman uh, are wild race, we're, uh, but we're wild racing. So it makes it into a verb? Yes. I actually want to work in my community. Yeah. Um, Self identity and um, knowing who you are and where you came from is very important. And the kind of knowledge I want to spread is empowerment for my people and my youth. When I stood up in the rice bed and looked and seen all the students out there, you know, and that we're going to keep it alive. To me, um, it's so obvious that it's good for kids and that this way of teaching is good for our kids in this community. Okay, next group, let's do it. Right answer. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah.